BBC Breakfast presenters Naga Munchetti and Charlie State often talk BBC viewers through some of the newspaper headlines which have caught their eye. On Friday's installment, the duo had selected interesting stories to share, but as Naga began to describe her article, she was left sighing and glaring at the cameras over Charlie's misunderstanding of it. Naga and Charlie present the BBC Morning Show on Thursdays and Fridays, but the former was absent during this Thursday's show, with Nina Warhurst stepping in instead. However, she was back on Friday and she and Charlie were able to resume their usual jokey interactions. Showing a clear picture of a calf with a big smiley face on its body, Naga remarked, a calf with a smiley face. Bringing just some joy this morning. A smiley face? Charlie asked, looking confused before Naga pointed at the unique marking and stated, there. Oh, you know what, I was looking at his head. Charlie commented, which is normally where the face is. Naga paused and glared at the cameras in silence over Charlie's misunderstanding. She raised her eyebrows in frustration before continuing sarcastically, so, this is a calf that was born in West Gippsland in Australia, with the smiley face there, right? And it's a nice story that in a way, it's now because of the markings, it's now being spared the abattoirs, and it's called happy because of the smiley face on the side of its body. So it can look forward to a future being kept as a pet instead, with the smiley face on the side of its body. The pair had also shared a laugh over Charlie's chosen story. As he introduced it he stated, this is a story about jockeys, who we traditionally think of as being short. This is Jack Andrews who's competing and he is 6 foot 4. Amongst the jockey community, it's very big. He says himself he towers over most of his fellow jockeys. There's no height limit for jockeys, it's all in relation to their weight. So you know, in theory you can be that high and it's not an issue, don't miss. Piers Morgan compares Oscars stars to strippers in Fresh Rant, latest, Jennifer Aniston swears during Awkward This Morning interview, video, Coronation Street fans work out Sally will expose Stephen, theory, how much does he weigh then? Naga questioned, to which Charlie answered, well, he says he weighs 10 stone 4 pounds. At 6 foot 4. Naga gasped before Charlie continued, at 6 foot 4. Because weight is the big issue in relation to horse riding. But he states a couple of things, which is kind of thing that if I said, I would seem really stupid. He said, if you're short, you're sometimes perched on top of the back of the horse and they can get the better of you, whereas if you're a big lad, you can manhandle the horse, and he says it's literally because he can get his legs further around the horse. So has saying he can get his legs, because they're longer, further around the horse, which is a statement of glaringly obvious, it's what the man says, Jack Andrews at 6 foot 4. Naga appeared very puzzled by the story and commented, I'm not sure that it would be completely comfortable wrapping your legs around the girth of a horse, whilst, you know, it's galloping at who knows what miles an hour? Because you are supposed to be when you gallop, you're supposed to be on top of those because you can't exactly sit and bump on the horse. I think what he'll do probably is take the testimony of Jack Andrews jockey over your expertise in the area. That's all I'm saying, Charlie hit back. I think probably he knows what Hess talking about. Given Hess riding horses at Cheltenham. He does say if anything, has gotten a bit of an advantage. This is his words, if you're in any doubt, 
He says, if anything, I have a bit of an advantage in that I can wrap my legs around horses better. You've said this already. Naga cut in before her co-star explained, I'm just making sure we understand that that is what Jack Andrews says. BBC Breakfast airs weekdays from 6 a.m. on BBC One. i